Hello, hello, and welcome to this quick pick a card. So this is going to be one more pick a card, and then I'm going to head to bed. Because my spirit guide says that it is getting late. <laughs> so um, if you haven't picked from the piles, go ahead and pick one, two, and three. And the title is going to be about who is in love with you. So I will tell you who is in love with you, okay? So this is pile number one pile number two and pile number three okay so pick one wisely you can pause it here okay one two and three okay so pick one that you feel that would resonate with you and what would go for you okay you could pause it right here okay but I'm gonna go ahead and get started okay so please keep in mind that this is general so it's kind of best to take what fits for you and what goes for you okay so let's um move to pile number one okay so this is like for an air sign okay first of all um let me see here uh, what i'm reading here so what i'm reading here is that um somebody's in deep contemplation okay so somebody is in deep thought about you okay and i think it's multiple people Okay, because with the poverty card here, like um, a poor person, like a really sad person that like they look, you know, abandoned. Okay, so I feel like who's secretly in love with you still is definitely your exes. Okay, definitely all of them. Because what it is, is that um, they are sad because you were such a wonderful person to them, but you weren't but they weren't wonderful to you and so they did the things they did because it's like weird like um you were too good for them and that happens right that actually happens believe it or not of why people cheat so people cheat or do certain things because you're kind of too good to be true and they get overwhelmed by the over too good to be trueness and so they're not able to handle the love and acceptance that you give them type of situation so yeah um that is who's in love with you okay um and they're thinking about you too with the thoughts okay so these people are constantly in their head they're constantly thinking about you because they think about how much you gave them and how they regret it but understand all this stuff came true because um to bring in a, a new person in your life and i feel like you're, like you're talking to them and they're good to you and spirit says to trust whoever has been guided to you recently because they are for your highest good but yes um that's who is in love with you my dear is pound number one is people from your past if that resonates with you go ahead and give me um a like comment subscribe okay uh sorry not like comment, subscribe. just give me a thumbs up okay or you know subscribe if you feel guided to do so so um we're gonna move on to pound number two so right off the bat, pile number two, um, I feel like this is really going to make your day. I don't know why, but I feel like this is going to really make your day because maybe you've kind of been in the down of the dumps lately, especially about this person, okay? So right off the bat, this is definitely a Libra that's in love with you, okay? So how I know for sure is because I'm seeing the lover's card. And so when I see the lover's card, I see somebody that's, um, they're very loving, okay? So this is what you have to, um your ancestors really like to come through a lot okay um aka your higher self okay because they say that we do our job but it's mostly you okay because they say that you play a big role on the planet and um they mostly get your higher self to come through but they do say that they're the ancestors just to kind of like make you pay attention a little but it's your higher self as well so um we're just gonna say it's ancestors coming through okay but um yes it is ancestors as well okay but they say it's you too um your higher self so um who is in love with you definitely libra um and definitely this is the person where um they're very interesting you know um i see that this person um i think a lot of people they would appear that because she's very beautiful or they're very good looking they would go out on dates a lot but they don't go out. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> so, 
Um, people find it very weird because this person's single. So there's a lot of people that talk about her <laughs> at her work and say, how is she so beautiful and doesn't have a relationship at least, or at least has somebody in her life. Like, you know, I, I don't understand. Like, you know, I, I don't understand. So there's a lot of people that talk about her at her workplace or just anywhere. Okay. Even, um, friends of, um, the siblings are like, you know, she is so beautiful. You know, why doesn't she have a boyfriend or something or like, and then there's people that would like, they would die to be with her really. So there's so many people that think she's very beautiful and they, they cannot begin to fathom why, um, she's single why she's not with anybody <laughs> so this is a feminine okay so yeah that's the funny part is um uh the person that is in love with you um a lot of people don't understand they're like you know she is so beautiful why would she why is she by herself you know why doesn't she go out on a date and put herself out there and it's because this woman she's the type of woman to wear she kind of just trusts the journey, okay? So she is a type of person where um, if love comes to her, it comes to her. But it's funny because, like, this person, they are, like, so to themselves to where if they don't have a relationship, they're fine with that. <laughs> so this person, what's really interesting about this person is they are highly ruled by Venus, okay? And so... um it could, when they're ruled by Venus, it could be a huge imbalance when they don't love themselves or it can be a balance when they do love themselves. Because let me tell you, people that are ruled by Venus in their sign, they they will um, freaking just, wow, like, I'm telling you. But there's not any of people like that anymore. There's not. I think this is the only person that I'm reading off of that governs strong self-love of Venus to wear they they're okay with being alone so they've been doing this for like years okay so this person it's weird so it's like this person's really beautiful but they like to stay alone not in a bad one they don't do it on purpose because you're probably like oh well maybe i'm interrupting their space no they're not you're not um it's just this person um they are very complicated to read and i think it's because this person has some kind of fucking moon in some kind of water sign okay so maybe there's like a scorpio part to this person okay so there is this libra side of beauty okay where you could see their beauty right like this outside but there is this scorpio side to them to where yeah i think this person has scorpio in their chart pile number two so this person they definitely you don't know what they're up to <laughs> that's the funny part about it and it confuses you a bit because you're like, well, there's one day where I think you like me. Maybe you do. I don't know. Okay. So you don't know. Okay. So, um, this person, they're very resistant on, tell, on, on coming through. Um, I think you've tried to give them, get tarot readings on them and you don't get any clear energy. And it's because they, they're kind of a witch a little bit. <laughs> So this person's kind of a witch they don't like to reveal themselves to anybody <laughs> like and if they're exposed they'll be they'll be so upset they're like oh no like don't do that to me so um yeah this person's a witch like this person they have like a psychic power of knowing how to not reveal themselves to people it's so fucking weird so this person they have a gift okay so understand this person they have a gift to wear um they can hide their feelings really well or hide it's weird it's not in a bad it's not in a deceptive way it's just like this person like you'll never know if they're in if you're in if they're in love with you like there is no sign or anything oh my god i feel so bad for you pal too oh my god so yeah okay look fine i'm gonna have to like this person does not want you to is it they don't want you to know okay so this person doesn't want you to know because um they feel like you aren't open to it okay they feel like you wouldn't i don't know this person's so fucking weird but this person says that they're in love with you okay pile number two i don't give a fuck what you this person is madly in love with you 
Okay, this person thinks a lot of naughty thoughts about you. Okay, like I said, I'm exposing them on the forefront. They don't want to come out. They don't, but I'm gonna I'm just fucking put it out. So yes, they do think naughty thoughts about you. They think you are the most sexiest person in the world. Okay, they think that you are the most attractive person that they've ever seen. Okay, see this person, they won't show it to you. Okay, they won't show it to you, but I'm telling you, like, you just caught the witch. Okay, that's what I'm saying, file number two. You just caught this person. Okay, so this person, they, I feel bad. Okay, I don't know. I don't know if I'm gonna get my ass whipped because I told on them, but I feel like you had to know because you're like, oh, I cannot fucking figure out this person. Like, they have, like, fucking they're so good at hiding how they feel but they're just doing it because they're just good at hiding their feelings okay so understand that <laughs> don't even read motives with this person don't even read hints okay just know and trust that they do feel that way towards you okay because this person they're fuckers they fucking hide they are a fucking witch they will not reveal to you that they're in love with you they're fucking good at it it's fucked up oh my god this person is like you know what this person could be? They could be like, I don't know, like a person in a reality show where like, <laughs> it kind of sounds like a person that's a murder, like in a crime scene. Like you'll never know if they did it or they did it or not. That's this type of person, okay? It's like this person, like you will never know what they're up to. <laughs> And it's not that it's a deceptive thing. Like, it's not that it's deceptive. It's just like this person, <laughs> they're so good at hiding their feelings. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, pile number two. But yes, this person is madly in love with you. They're crazy about you. They think about you every minute, okay? So this person, oh my god, they are so in love with you. They just won't show it. They're just being like... But So just know that their way of showing they love you is that they'll send you messages okay so that's one of your messages is um they'll be like are you okay that's one of the signs okay so there you go if you want a physical thing that's how you know they're in love with you is that they won't check up on anybody else but you let me tell you that's another thing too about this person so they don't talk to anybody else they don't okay this person they would rather stay alone by themselves but apparently you're the exception that they talk to i just expose them on the front okay so yeah, that's that's what I have for your pile number two. Now you know your answer, and you could chase that little fucking witch, and you could say, I caught you. Okay, so you could just grab her and be like, I know what you up to. Don't you fool me. So you have to tell her to her face and say, yeah, I know you're playing a little motherfucking trick with me. So don't let the witch fool you, okay? So we're moving on to pile number three. So um, who is in love with you, pile number three? Dang. Well, it looks like everybody <laughs> is in love with you. <laughs> I feel like this is definitely for a feminine, for um, a Libra female or like, um, um, I don't know. This is really cute. So um, I think that you have a person that is really in love with you. Um, this person... If you have been losing follows or people haven't been talking to you, it's because this person, they've been doing like some black magic to keep them away, okay? This person needs to behave. Who else is in love with you? Oh my god! People think you're so adorable. They think you are cute. Mature man. Yes. There is a mature man that I think you know who it is that is after you this person is spying on you thief they want to steal you away pile number three this person says that you're not going to get away with what you're doing <laughs> so i don't know if that's even naughty or whatever so so they think that you're hiding something not in a bad way but they think that you're hiding the way they the way you feel about them okay and so just know that they're on to you okay so if this person this person might come in with a message and say they might tease you a little bit and pick on you and be like hello like they might say so oh my god <laughs> this, person, this person's gonna come in with the message and i feel like this person's gonna say well hello there and so 
they might tease you a little bit and kind of nitpick at you and say, oh, I feel like you're hiding something from me. So this person, they might be a little bit of a busybody when they talk to you. They'll be like, because this person, they're like, I don't know, they give me like this strong masculine energy. So I feel like this person, they're going to come in and they're going to be like, you know, I feel like you're not telling me something. Like you're, you're very good at whatever you do, but you're not going to get away with it is what this person's saying. So I feel like this person, they, they say, they're saying that you in trouble. You are in trouble, pal. Three. <laughs> so this person, they're madly in love with you. And what they want to say is they say, you're in trouble. If you think you don't, this person says that they feel that you're up to something, that you're in love with them, but you don't want to admit it. And you're just playing hard to get. <laughs> so I feel like this person, they're going to come in with the message and say, oh, so you playing games, huh? You, you being a witch. And I'm gonna figure you out. So this person, they're gonna they're gonna send you a message and they're gonna pick on you and say, Yeah, I know you're up to something, miss. I, I know you want me, miss. You know, they're just, they're gonna tease you this other month. They're gonna come in and tease you a little bit, okay, because they, they're in love with you. But um who else is in love with you? I don't know. Um I think a lot of people they are. People that you work with, they think you are adorable. They think you are the most adorable thing they've ever met in their entire life, okay? Because you could be short or you could just, like, you're really cute. Um, I'm trying to spare this because I definitely feel some evil. <laughs> I try to be whooped on me. Like, don't say anymore. I think this is just coming in with a divine masculine, okay? Because he's your protector. But, um, yes, um, some people, they're, they're like, other people in love with the one. When are you going to get married? you better find somebody else so they sometimes these people they put in print i better not say anymore but just know that some people they're madly in love with you okay they're madly in love with you and they talk about how beautiful you are that you are beautiful okay and they wish they were with you okay so that's what i have for you if that resonates with you go ahead and give me a like comment subscribe well give me a like not a comment